What's up everyone, Drew here, we're taking a look at Google Maps for iOS. This is officially available for the iPhone and iPod Touch inside the App Store for free. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. So right here it is, and this is iPhone 5 support, and right there is the application for Google Maps. It's kind of cool, it looks a lot better than the previous maps for iOS 5, but this is for iOS 6. So let's go ahead and open it up here. If you are tired of iOS 6 maps, Google is definitely the way to go. Whenever you first open it up, it pinpoints your exact location, so on. So it's a very nice clean UI. It fits the iPhone 5 nicely. Up on the top left, we have our search. So we can go ahead and search. And then on the bottom left, we have our redirection to our location. Over here on the right, we have traffic, public, Google Earth, so on. And we can even search. So let's go ahead and search. Chicago, it's wanting us to sign in, we're not signed in. So I just paste it in there just to make the video faster. So here we go, it gives us places in Chicago. And we'll just go ahead and click Chicago. There it is, it even dropped the pin for us. You can actually click on Chicago, Illinois. And here it is, you can even share. And basically you have your sharing options, message, mail, copy, and cancel. We'll just cancel this and you even have Street View. We'll take a look at Street View here in a minute. You can go ahead and pinch all the way in. It's very fast. No lag at all. Just look at that. You can pinch out. Just go all the way out as well. Let's go ahead and take a look at the actual Street View itself. Here it is. Here's Street View. You can have it in landscape. And it looks very clean. You can see all the cars, people. You got a guy with a suitcase there. So on, it just looks very nice. Take a look at all the buildings. You got American flag right there in Chicago. The buildings look very clean. You can go ahead and walk the streets. So on, all the people, cars, looks very nice. And we can even get out of this by turning it back, pressing up, pressing the arrow, and we can even route it. So on, and we got car, bus, walk, Let's see what else we can do here, my location, you can learn more, reverse it, pretty cool, and you got your routes once again, and you can set up a whole entire new map to when you're driving, you could have it take you to your exact location, and so on, so there you go, that's kind of been a quick first look at Google Maps for iOS, I definitely have been waiting for this because I'm not a big fan personally of the iOS 6 maps that Apple design. I mean it's an alright system but it has a lot of bugs to work out but if you missed Google this is definitely the route to go because this is the official Google iOS 6 maps so definitely make sure you guys check it out it is free so why not give it a download and so if you guys like this video you're gonna make sure to subscribe give this video a thumbs up drop all of your comments down below follow us on Facebook and Twitter for more up-to-date news all those links are down below in the description Till next video guys, we'll see you all in the next one.